Praise God, praise God. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. If you see my title, it says, Stop Looking on the Internet for Bible Truths. Because I found this article, and let's look at what it says. It says, Who killed Goliath, David, or Alahanna? Um, and first of all, it doesn't make any sense. So it says that in 1 Samuel 17, 15, it says that David killed Goliath. And then it says that, but the verse... Second Samuel twenty one nineteen seems to indicate that Elahan killed him and not David. So killed the giant. And I say, now why are they doing that? You know, trying to confuse people. So, because most people are getting lazy, they don't want to go into the Bible. So this verse, I want you to look at this verse. Second Samuel twenty one nineteen seems to indicate that it was Elahan and not David who killed the giant. I say, oh Lord, they lying. So here's the verse. I want to show y'all the verse. This is this this is twenty one nineteen. See, people need to read very thoroughly. And there was again, it means another battle in Goab with the Philistines, where Elanhan, the son of Jeragon, a Belanite, slew the brother of Goliath, the Gentite. You know, the staff of whose spear was like a weaver's beam. And I say, you see, this is how people can get confused and thinking that, well, it was something else read your bible that's what i'm really saying learn to get in the bible stop googling stuff stop getting on the internet go to the bible itself because you see it looks like a just simple thing right but it's really not because it clearly says here in the scripture slew the brother of goliath but this article here if a person is not reading a bible they would think it was another person that slew look at it at, uh, it, it actually says that who killed Goliath, you know, so they're questioning the Bible. I told you in this last hour, everything would be questioned because what they want to do is they want to make Christians seem like we're crazy. We don't know what we're talking about. Um, one of the things that I want y'all to really understand, I want y'all to remember the word extremist. I'm very serious about this. Remember the word extremist. Why am I telling you to remember that word? Because that's what they will call um, all of us that are truly into God, truly serving God, and they would, some of us will be arrested. Oh, I'm telling you what does said the Lord. Just remember I said it. They will say that they are an extremist and they will say that by being an extremist, that you're breaking the laws of, of the nation. So some will be arrested. Remember I said it, it's coming, it's coming quicker than you think too. So this was just short. I just wanted to let you know how people are misinterpreting things, but hold on. They're putting false stuff on the internet on purpose so people can be confused. They don't want you to be a Christian. They don't want to hear Jesus Christ. That one day, uh, actually, what they're going to do actually, again, the name of Jesus Christ, you will be arrested for using that name. And that's a thus said the Lord. Y'all think I'm kidding. It's all coming. It's going to all come to pass. They hate the laws of God. They hate Christianity. That's why you're seeing the movement of homosexuality like never before. God says that they're trying to stop the order of God. And if they stop the order of God, then they're thinking that they'll stop people from serving God. But that's that's far from the truth. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So God bless you. God keep you. Learn to get in your Bible yourself. Hallelujah. So this is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll out soldiers, for that is who we are. God bless.